there! Welcome back to The Spell, where we'll be going through the entire s Which is the story as we freaking can. <laughs> Do you have kids? Now she's bringing up questions. She asked, wishing it would be the case. The man was already more than enough on his own. She wouldn't know how to deal with an entire family. No. Now we know. He, he's a lone soul. <laughs> Steve replied instantly. A girlfriend? This is a time to be to ask more questions. <laughs> she asked with even more speciation for her for the answer. What kind of woman would willingly be with a man like him? There is someone for this man. We I know this. There is someone for him out there. No. He answered again without hesitation. Why? I don't know. Why are you asking? Oh, well, either way, they're both asking questions, damn it. She pointed at the picture. He looked at it, he looked at it for a second, scratched his head, then immediately threw it into the trash. As she thought, something wasn't right. Are you hungry? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Is it the time to panic? <laughs> he asked as if there was nothing wrong with his actions this far. <laughs> there are reasons. <laughs> More questions must be taken. <laughs> He took her by surprise. She generally thought about it for, for a second. As she completed, complimented the idea, her eyes gradually looked down on the floor, and her mouth even so slightly formed the upper half of a circle. She finally shook her head. From left to right, there's no way she would be hungry. That's no good. What do you mean it's no good? More questions must be asked, dammit! We don't know any other thing about these two characters outside of one's a child and her parents. Something happened. <laughs> he said as if worried, though he... He's complex and didn't show any sign of emotion. You gotta eat something. Like what? Please tell me there's food. <laughs> he walked to a nearby cabinet, opened it, didn't even look inside, and grabbed two cups of noodles from it. Here you go. Please explain! He dumped it into her hands. She looked at the thing with big surprised eyes. You're mean! I can already tell that you might have threw it somewhere. Then she looked at the man with the same eyes. While doing so, she s slowly, gently, she took two steps to the front of the front of her, smiled at him, and dropped the thing into the trash. Okay, that's mean. That's just straight, straight mean. The man looked at her, a bit confused. Maybe he blinked. It blinked a handful of times, and then threw his into the trash as well. What a weird man. She concluded. <sighs> I, 
I have questions, but it ain't gonna help shit. <laughs> he walked away, sat in the living room couch, picked up a book and lay on the coffee table, and started reading. Now you have to deal with uh, everything else. Is he going to leave her like this? Aren't there more steps to follow? For this kind of trans translation, like shower, show her around the place, show showing her around the place, starting the root, uh, yeah, starting the rules of the house, or simply taking a bit more out of themselves. Actually, that would make sense. <laughs> or don't kill anyone on the way in. <laughs> No, she wanted to do it. She wanted wanted to do any of those things, but still, she was not comfortable with the lack of structure right now. She knows that she found herself lost without a proper direction. There's more questions than answers here. She looked at him for some time, and then finally remembered something important. Something she had completely forgotten about. She opened the backpack she was carrying, and immediately found an object in question. Her cell phone. Wait, she has a freaking phone? Isn't she in, like, grade school? Well, I couldn't really question outside of that. Nowadays, kids actually have phones. She boosted it. She booted it up and was instantly greeted with it by multiple notifications. They all came from the, some source. Her best friend? Damn, that's not going to question any of that. I don't want to know. She peeked at the last message she received. Only two words. Stay strong. Yeah, how, how is a kid going to freaking do that? More questions are going to be answered than anything else. And not any of the good ones, too. She found herself smiling to herself. Despite the situation, she was not alone. She realized. She took a deep breath. A deep breath deep breath and then turned her eyes to the creepy man well he's pale as shit what's the name of the wi-fi there is none wait you have no wi-fi yes that's how we teach kids to this. oh wait i have to use wi-fi <laughs> No, I just have my shit plugged into the router. <laughs> he answered all while turning the page of his book. <laughs> this actually makes it easy. You have to learn. <laughs> Learning is good for child. <laughs> she was discouraged. Yet... He finally added, looking at her way. I'll call tomorrow. From what? What do you call it? She sighed, both in relief and description. She will have to use her own data for now. She was re relegated. <laughs> yes. To use no reluctant to use her use it ever since she was ex since she excuted no, extended the limit one time she remembered her mother sc scolded her for it her mother she can't scold her now <laughs> no uh this dude seems relatively chill. But I'd like to know what the hell he does. By what I'm guessing, by what we 
got so far. He kind of sits around, reads, just does stuff like that, considering that he's pale as all fuck. <laughs> well, I also found that situation, goddammit, so I can't complain too heavily. <laughs> and I do the polar opposite of what this guy does. Shit. Now when I think about it, I just do this shit all the, the good majority of the night, so goddammit. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> she just realized that her phone was shaking. Or was it her whole body? Uh... This doesn't help. I have to voice two characters. <laughs> there was not the time for this. She wanted to be strong, if only in front of this strange man. Suddenly, she felt the embrace pressure of, a, of her hand, head, of her head, and somehow a familiar sensi sensation, a hand, his hand, on her head. He was in front of her for now, for how long, for a long time. She did not know. Was he trying to cheer her up? But well, when you don't really deal with kids, it's, it's gonna be kinda difficult to get the vibe and shit. It's gonna make it work. She raised her eyes. Ever so slightly. He is he a good person after all? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how to read him yet. I shake. I shake too when I'm hungry. <laughs> He's trying. I can at least give him that. He's trying. Uh. I can't judge him for- I can't judge him for this. He's trying hard. He has this little human that he needs to keep an eye on. <laughs> he said with a, two cups of noodles in his hand. <laughs> you still don't- you still don't- still not hungry, goddammit. He's at least trying, god dang it. There's things to do. You can download music on your phone for when you get fucking Wi-Fi and shit. You don't need Wi-Fi. Stay alive. Fuck's sake, I can easily just record videos without fucking Wi-Fi. Will be a pain in the ass? Yes. But who cares? <laughs> she should have known better than to expect anything from him. <laughs> He's trying! At least give him that, damn it! Damn it, Dots! Why? At least you're better than triple question mark! Slurp. Slurp. <laughs> you should have been more honest with yourself. He told her while well, slurping his noodles away. Annoyingly. At least he's trying. He's better than some people nowadays. She gave in. Not that she wanted to eat in the trash, but it's the only thing edible in this house. And while she doesn't want to admit it, Steve was right. It did help. Sorta. Hey, food can never be judged. It can only be eaten. <laughs> you know that I literally had like a couple of cookies earlier. Hey, who cares? I'm most likely to fall asleep soon after. I don't care. I have my own shit to do. This is what her mother called all those junk foods, trash, so she never had really eaten one of the, these, and as expected, it was not up to her standards. Salty, extremely so, and soggy. Well, you can't judge it. That's the shit I eat normally. <laughs> Filled full of uh, salt, sugar, and shit. What do you expect from me? I hide in the basement, goddammit. But 
but it was not that bad. It was warm. Yeah, he just chucked it in the microwave. <laughs> they both ate in silence. Slurp, slurp. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> you know that I'd like to joke with that. Have fun just like throwing shit. <laughs> I have to be vaguely professional. <laughs> Which is very, very freaking hard. <laughs> when you have this shit. Uh, I'll see you guys next time, and I hope all of you have a great moment of time. <laughs> well, I freaking find ways to freaking joke about that. Uh, see you guys next time. <laughs> what the fuck?